Hi everyone, it's James in Japan. It is July 6th, 2022. I'm going to show you how to make delicious instant karage. Karage means battered chicken balls. This is by a company called Nishin. You can buy this package at any supermarket and even at Daiso. This part says karage. This kanji is powder. There is 10% more. This costs about 150 yen. On the back of it, it shows you how to make it. It's so easy. And you can use chicken wings or chicken breasts, whatever you want. It's really easy. If you don't know how to cook, no problem. This powder is seasoned. It's sort of like North America's shake and bake, if you know what I'm talking about. So I have a piece of chicken breast and chicken drumsticks. And this is my dinner for tonight. I'm not going to eat all of it. Anyway, I need to use up this chicken. So I'm going to cut up this chicken and I'm going to show you how to prepare it. Here is my plain chicken. It hasn't been seasoned. I'm going to open this karage package and show you the contents. To open it, you'll see a little slit on the side of it. Most Japanese packaging have a little slit for you to easily open it. Okay, you see it right there? Just pull that across carefully. I was wrong about the bag. There is no bag inside. You need to get a separate bag or a Ziploc for the powder. Okay, it shows you exactly how to do it. So you're going to put your chicken and your karage powder in the same bag and mix it up. Okay, after that, step two, three minutes later, you're ready to go. Step three, three minutes later, heat up some oil to 160 to 170 degrees Celsius. Then place the chicken inside or into golden brown. It is going to taste fantastic, nice and crispy. This is really easy to make. You're going to love it. I'm using a plastic bag. So put your chicken inside first. Okay, first I've got the chicken inside. Now for the karage mixture. I'm using the whole package. It's up to you if you want to use all of it. It's really cheap. And it says number one. Okay, and now you're going to mix it up. You can use your hands or just close up the bag and swirl it around. It's up to you. Guys, I decided not to use my hands for this video. You're gonna just mix it up as much as you can. Make sure you coat all the chicken. This is going to be this is going to be amazing. Trust me. If you don't plan to eat this right away, you can put this in the refrigerator. All right, I've got oil in this frying pan. It's nice and hot. It's about 160 degrees Celsius. I haven't tested it. If you don't have a thermometer, just throw in some flour and you'll notice this. See, that's pretty hot. Okay, you can use tongs or chopsticks. I'm just using my fingers. I'm going to cook up the drumsticks. They take longer. Make sure you space them out. Sorry about that. It's hard to cook with uh, my puppy in the background barking. So I've got four drumsticks in. You should heat it uh, medium to high. Don't turn it over right away. I've got six drumsticks in. Sorry about the background noise if my puppy might bark. Okay, let it cook through. You can, you can check some of them. Okay, this is nice. Okay, so it's ready to turn over. If it's this color, beautiful, just beautiful. Okay, it's about five minutes. I'm going to test one of these. Oh my god, look at the color of it. It's fantastic. Make sure you don't overcook the chicken. Okay, I'll just sample one. Oh my god, it's hot. I'm going to quickly eat this one before my dog starts barking. So hot. Oh my god, it's fantastic. Always make sure it's cooked thoroughly. This is fantastic. I've got a winner here, guys. That's it for this video. Thanks for watching. Like and try this.